Hey guys, Lee here, playing some Hex. I'm here with my buddies Jackson and Brandon. They're in a Skype call. We are going to open some packs today. So I have 10 of the Primal Dawn and 2 of the Primal Primal Dawn, which I guess is guaranteed legendaries or guaranteed legendary chest. There's a chance that you'll get a free additional card back. Maestro of Alacrity. 3-3 three, three for 4 when an elf enters player you control it gets speed it's got a two percent chance per pack so it doesn't matter it doesn't take. huh okay oh okay well we get a legendary chest from that i'm not gonna be opening his chest today no Just a car of Arendelle. Have you guys seen that yet? Yes. The four four, four uncounterable for three. Oh my god. That's really strong. And it can't be countered, which is awesome. Let's see what else we get. I think you'll see more than us. Another rare. No legendaries yet. Yo, this dark for tail color, oh, tail Lana cutter. Oh, side is actually really strong. Yeah, I have a couple of those. That's I really good. That, I use that in my in some of my decks. It's really good. Transmogrified. That's a hilarious card. That's, that's a really good card. I that's my second one. I think I got my last one. Um, doing an evolving sealed. Turn target thing into weaker thing, except it got them this like ridiculous four six flying unique, which was I was pissed. Because it's a straight up red disc, but it's a one mana investment. There's the heart stuff lost where RNG is going to use. Beguiling Temptress, 1 3 for 3. What does it do? Ready target opposing troop with attack. Oh! Especially against the AI, which will never make the right play against it. Oh my god, that's insane. PvE, it's not as strong, but against any sort of AI in this game, you. Yeah, you just buff it and then they can't do anything anymore. Well, no, you don't even need to buff it against the AI because if you steal it and attack with it, they'll block it. Like, they'll whittle their own creatures down until you just win. Wait, so which set are you opening Primal Dawn? I'm opening 10 Primal Dawn, then I have two of the Primal Primal packs. Okay, gotcha. The Primal Primal Dawns. I got one Shards of Faith Primal pack. Anything good from it? We haven't, I haven't opened yet, I'm waiting. Exemplar of the Awakened. That's alright. That's pretty, necrotic that's, deck, pretty yeah, cool. Necrotic, I kind of want to build them just black-white, right? Yeah, if, if you shift a bunch of stuff onto, if you can somehow shift Spell Shield onto him, he becomes insane. Oh, well, yeah. If I were to make a theme deck, it'd probably be Shin Hair. I just like the swarm. Uh, just, well, it's also the rabbits, which is hilarious so when to me. you would generate a Shin Hair, you would generate an additional. Mm -hmm. Reap, oh my god, Reap is so good. Yeah, Reap is a Reap's good. good. That is insane. Elder of Visions, yes. Nice. Yes. When this or another Kyoto, oh my gosh, that's awesome. That kind of makes you just want to play like Kyoto Green now. That with the uh, the two two that gives Crush. Ooh. Lead out another Lanapos, another Chill. I love how Chill is no cost, like no Chill. Yeah. Ah, Transmogrified. Another one. I feel like that that's gonna go up in price at some point. Someone's gonna realize how ridiculous it is. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't see it. Cry of the Eagle. Oh, it's all right. Cry of the Eagle. Does that make the Spirit Eagles? No, I think it just prophesizes. Oh. Something. I don't remember. Another dark fur tail cutter. That's cool. Green paw emancipator. Shroompin put them in a. Sh oh. What is that? That's cool. That's a magic card. Creates yeah. two two two's. Just, uh, what is it? Her, uh, oh my god, if you empower that, that's insane. Creates yeah, four four. Creates four two twos that... No, it creates four three threes because the empower buffs yeah, his the, buff. The buffs, yeah. Yeah. God, that's really good. And for like 4, power. <laughs> Dang. I mean, there are other cards I'd be playing for 10 mana if I actually had 10 mana, but that's pretty good yeah. still. I mean, you'd be playing you never lose that 10 mana if you get to that point. Right. Like, that's the whole point of Empowers. If you draw them later in the game, they 
Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You you can play them early. Another Tale of Destiny. Don't you want this, Brandon? I kind of do, but not really. You got to get a couple more uniques. If I had good uniques, I would want that. Get the get the the two one uh uh Coyote. The... I mean, honestly, if you're running a ramp draw deck and you only have one unique in your deck, if you haven't drawn it each time you play one of those, you would give an additional take an additional turn. And especially since you're using the recycle card, if your unique goes away, dies, you can just recycle it back into your deck and then reapply that. It's, it's really not that In bad. PvP, it's good, but I'm saying, yeah, I just don't have any good uniques that I would like to build. Well, I mean, I have that. That two drop for one, the Kyotl. Yo, a legendary in pack 10. That, that dude that copies all the copies. Are you all ready? Oh, yep. yep. What do we got? Is this his primal down, right? Yep. Law. Create a Scrapyard Magnetron and put it into play. At the end of the turn, put a random non-unique junk from your crypt into play. I'm guessing that's Scrapyard Magnetron. From your crypt into your hand. That is... Wow, that's interesting. I... And when it dies, you create the bruiser, too. Yeah, he's like a giant value engine who just creates free creatures. Oh my god, I would play this. I would totally play that. You just get the colorless land that produces double. Get like a yeah. million different robots each time those die. Like, yeah, so that's cool. awesome. And then you can also abuse the card, like the colorless cards that get buffed from thresholds. Oh, there's also a. All right. Yeah. All right, guys. That was uh that was the the ten primal dawn packs, and now we have two of the primal primal dawn primal, packs. Primal 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 primal, primal 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 dawn primal. Here we go. Double legendaries. Another Darmac. I don't like him, but he's cool, I guess. Seven seven flyer for everything. He's good. What's the what other is, one? What is that? Oh okay. my god. Yes. Yeah, That's awesome. Um, Freak yeah, of was, nature. Freak of nature, which I think I have. <gasps> you got our chisel cheese smith. Oh, oh I want it. I'll have to look at it. At the end of your turn, a random opposing troop gets minus one, minus one to start your turn. If this is in your crypt, this one plus one. While this is in your crypt, pay four health and put other four, or put four of the troops from your crypt into your deck. Play this for free. That's, that's good. I would play that. Artisanal cheese smith. Where's he at? Where is he at? Is it great? Artisanal cheese smith is a is a for your elf deck. A random cheese and put it into your hand. When this deals damage to an opposing champion, each cheese in your hand ferments, getting cost of minus. <laughs> that's awesome. Okay, what do cheeses do? Different things. There's a bunch of different types. There's a creature cheese. There's a. I actually will trade you really pretty aggressively for that card. Oh my god, that's awesome. Oh my god, and everything else in the deck is. Everything else in the pack is rares? Yeah, the. the what? Packs, you have about a 2% chance on each pack creation to get a primal pack. So I got really lucky. Yes. I only got one from buying 25 packs, and you got two. So. I got two from buying 10. Yeah. Oh, really? Wow. That's luck, dude. Oh my god. Yeah. So That's insane. You have about a 20% chance to get one, and you got two. So no, I create an action, play a Blaze Elemental, and put it in your hand. Blaze yeah. Elementals are cool, right? They're 3-1 Swiftness? Yeah, 3-1 Swiftness. Cool. Yeah, sack it end of turn. Alright, guys. Oh, plus the chest. Yeah, you're guaranteed Legendary Chest. Should I open it? Because I don't want to spin it. Let's open these two. Let's uh, let's uh, let's open them. You should save at least one. Just I have a ton of legendary chests that I haven't spun yet. Yeah, but you need to make sure you have at least one of each type. Okay. One of each Ooh. Type. Ooh. Ooh, cloud foot. Oh. Target troop gets flight. Okay. When this deals opposing oh damage. Oh my god. You can ah. play this for free. Okay, well, there's your PvE, Lan Lanty. There you go. And then dark. Dark. Oh, the dark fur tail cutter is so good. Oh, it gives your other shin hairs plus. Wow, that's, that's yeah. a shin haircut. I've got, I've opened quite a few of those. They're they're really good. Even in limited, they're good. It's a three two for three that just gives you value, especially if you hit the right uh, enemies. All right, last pack, guys. What are we gonna get? Shingami, yo. And a star caller ancient. When you draw prophetess cards. Oh my gosh, guys. Yeah, how you, you yeah, still want him. I still want that. Are you going to play the Tomb of uh, Nulzan? Ooh, the Limestone. The Limestone. Oh, nice. I think I have a Limestone. 
and Shingami Crush. When this deals damage to an opposing team, and you may void all troops you control if you do. Put all troops from your crypt into play. And this would end your crypt void it instead. Hmm. That's a hilarious card. Wait, what is on... Oh. Low battery. What is on what? Oh, oh Cyclone, Cyclone Shaper is the card I'm talking about. Okay. Yeah, I've, I've seen a few of those. He's good. Yes. That with the tail. Alright, guys. Well, that's going to be it for me. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Peace.